we are going to make footstep bearing its parts and, and then we will do assembly of it first thing that we need to do with any drying is we need to go and study the drying here we can see that this is one part which is in top view and front view or front top view and front view you can name it any way it's in third angle uh, sorry it's in first angle and this is the second part this is third part and this is fourth part so let's begin with the, the first part here here you can see this dimension 180 it shows that it has taper here so this length of 3 mm here is of this taper and total width is 16 so we will begin with this after that we can see that there are different diameters 60 dia, 64 dia, 60 dia these are internal diameters of this part and this dia 90 is outer diameter of this object here ok so it also has oblongs here you can see 15 by 22 15 is minimum dia and 22 is maximum dia its distance not from center but from this slot that has been cut under the piece that size is given 65 from this point to this point and center to center distance of these oblongs are, is 130 degree these both are body as arrows are defined the outer diameter here is 33 the oblong, oblong is 13 mm offset from this edge and from center it is offset by 28 from both sides symmetrically so this is your width 115 here you can see the height is 74 this hollow cylindrical part length is 58 and this oblong portion has a length of 3 mm and about this dia 60 it is from 16 to 13 so value of 60 dia is 13 for dia 64 the value is 34 for dia 60 again the length is 11 so this is how you will read a drawing whenever you receive a drawing first thing that you have to do is you have to observe a drawing you have to read it when you understand it clearly then it will be easy for you to draw this type of lines here you can see the difference between here it has mentioned 3 here so you need to find the dimensions first when dimensions are clear to you you can make the object as quick as possible so further we will continue with this drawing but presently you must understand this how you are going to read the drawing ok uh, I will explain how we will make this assembly and its part in the next video thank you